YouTube. So I just wanted to uh, throw this out. Uh, the recent subscribers, uh, at least the ones that gave me notification of uh, those that you know didn't. Sorry, I missed you. It, it doesn't give me all of them, just some of them. But and I apologize ahead of time for butchering some of these names. Oren Baza, J.K. Roan 1014, Crackle Black, Vincent Robinson, Grimming, James Kriegel. I'm not sure. A E N E A S, Todd Odo, Steve Miller, McCall Thompson, Roberta. Thanks for subscribing. I uh, hope you enjoy this video and and I I did a little looking because in this video I mentioned it my yard max log splitter has a uh, an upgraded hydraulic pump when when I ordered it yeah, I got a 17 gallon per minute pump on it and the other log splitter nearest I can tell is a 13 gallon per minute so you know hence the faster cycle time now on log splitter pumps they're a two-stage pump so the way they derive their 17 is interesting um, you have to look at the individual pump and I couldn't find the specs on that but there will be a high output low low volume and a low pressure high volume that's your whole two stage thing and the two of them added together will give you your 17 but most likely you're probably running like 13 gallon per minute at the lower pressure so once it gets like you're, you're actually using the log splitter and it, you know it, you hit a knot or something it runs a lot slower while it's building that pressure so that's why you'll see it slow way down when you get into something real real uh, tough but the stuff that splits a little easier that's where that you know the the uh, high volume one makes it nice because it spits it right out or uh, moves it right you know real quick the uh, and I do believe that at the lower pressure you're actually getting the full 17 gallon and then when you think about it you could figure out uh, you know the area of the cylinder you know to give you the volume and uh, how many gallons it takes to fill that and if in one minute you're pushing four more gallons through then obviously it's going to fill the cylinder quicker you know and uh, just save you time in the end so anyhow I'll start uh, the video now and hope you enjoy Well, hello YouTube. Well, I'm gonna do a little bit of uh, splitting here. I'm over at, the, at my parents' house. This is a uh, log splitter. It's a uh, yard machine. Looks like it has a by MTD. Has a six and a half horsepower motor on it. Twenty-six ton. Um, this one's got a bit of use. It's not like a whole ton of use, but it's definitely older than mine that's, you know, was bought this summer. Um, one thing you'll notice is this one has a set idle, whereas mine has the adjustable idle. Um, and this has a lower gallon per minute pump, so it does cycle slightly slower. They have it set up to split like this. And let me see. If you notice, right down there, they, uh, there's a little block in there. We do that on purpose, especially uh, when splitting in this orientation. Their wood's only uh, 12 inches long, so it allows you to use the auto return detent a little more effectively. I'll start off splitting like this 
then I'll probably tip it up horizontal once I got this area split out. And I might try and leave the block there, see how that goes, and get that split up. Um, now I know it's been a little while since I posted a video. I've been busy with other stuff, holidays, all that good stuff. But uh, did want to give you an update. Uh, I know a couple of people had asked for me to do so on the firewood salvage bid. So that was supposed to have closed on the 5th, but due to the government shutdown, uh, for services federal, um, that's been postponed until the 15th for the bid opening. And if we're still currently in the government shutdown, then, you know, it'll be delayed further. So I'll let you know when we figure that one out, but I uh, can't remember if I mentioned in the previous video, but you know, the I didn't record the first job I went out and put a bid in on it. Went for like 111 a cord. So if this goes that high, <laughs> I'm not winning it. So we'll, we'll see how she goes there. But uh, after that one, well, all you can do is throw your name in the pot and see. But I'm not going to overpay for it. I'll go about my normal means of getting it uh, if it's too expensive. Because if you pay too much for it, you're working for free or losing by the time you're done if you give yourself any sort of hourly wage you know it would be evidently she ain't quite warm
So here we go. We'll uh, switch it to this way. I think I got enough room. Get this thing turned around the right way. Now I wear this apron, I like to wear it when I'm splitting horizontal like that. Okay, so yeah, I like to wear this because otherwise it really destroys like your your pants and, and your shirt. The bigger you are here, the, the more that's affected, but uh, you know, you're just, you're up against it and it's like I, I kind of use my legs and stuff a lot doing it so let's there we go it's like it might be a little tight here to begin with but it's okay
switch it up. You can get uh, get my log splitter in over here. A couple things I noticed. One, the block kind of sucks because you're up out of the cradle to help hold it. But it's also nice, like I said, the reason it's used is they usually split it in the vertical position. And that lets you use that auto detent to run it back up. So, you know, and you are, <coughs> you know, this one doesn't have the same spinning deal on the bottom. It just has some, some, uh, looks almost like key stock or something welded on there that helps prevent them from kicking out. So you have to be aware of that. I'll drag this one out. This will work now one thing I, I didn't realize is it looks like yeah okay their log splitters actually set up better for splitting horizontal because the uh, main beam is shifted off center over there mine centered because at first I thought maybe theirs was narrower because you don't have to fight that tire as much. But that's not the case. So. Hmm. Let's get these earplugs in and we'll fire this one up and do some splitting. See how this one starts. It's been a few weeks. Might have to give her a few pulls, get, get some fuel through into the line there. Mm-hmm. 